So by the title of this video, you can tell we're gonna be wrapping presents. And this year I actually have Maya helping me. I usually do the wrapping on my own every year, but her presents are already all wrapped. They're in the back. Some are a little messed up because Julian has been tugging and pulling on us. So I've just been like taping them up and there's tape all over them. But their presents are all wrapped. So we just have our family members' presents to wrap. So we're gonna show y'all what we got them while we wrap. And then I don't know, maybe tell a story or two. Also, we have a movie on because Julian is a little crazy. So he might be like in and out of this video, grabbing wrapping paper, grabbing the presents, but we're just gonna have to work with it. What present do you wanna wrap first? We have them all stacked right here in front of us. Hey guys, um, I love this hat. Okay, so yeah, I'm Maya's feeling super festive, but so she has her little Santa hat on. So I chose this one. So this is actually a gift that we're giving to her cousin. And my her, dad got it. <laughs> yeah. So Jacob's sister actually just bought her cousins a PS5, and so Jacob's gonna be surprising them with a new game. And we're going easy on a lot of these presents. We got gift bags for a lot of presents because it's just, I don't know, it's just easier to do. I think we just need like one or two. Okay, that looks good. Okay, so we can set that off to the side. We got I one. I wonder if Julian's gonna like, go like, and like keep this one. Yeah, we gotta be careful with Julian. Okay, so you can set this one behind us. We did a lot of last minute Christmas shopping today and yesterday. Keep in mind that tomorrow is Christmas Eve, so today is the 23rd. My Okay, so here's the thing. I originally thought that we weren't going to do anything Christmas Eve. So I thought my dad was going to be in Mexico for Christmas. And then my sister just didn't know what she was going to do. She didn't know if she was going to come over here with me or she was going to go with my older sister. My dad ends up coming back home from Mexico. I think it was the 20th. And he like hits me up and he's like, hey, what are you doing for Christmas Eve? I'm like, I thought you were gonna be in Mexico, so I didn't plan anything. Long story short, they're gonna end up coming to my house. So we had a lot of last minute gifts, which I feel like for a last minute gift, it was, I still try, all right? I put effort into them. So my sister, she just let me know this morning, Friday, the day before Christmas Eve, that she's coming. So I did a little online order pickup and I actually really like this outfit. So I got her this little skirt that has this cute little like slit on the side, gray skirt. And I got her this little like green lime cardigan. I thought this was so cute. Like, what if this looks so cute with the little gray skirt? I don't know. I like it. Julian came in the front and he was like, he got off the couch and he came in the front and he was trying to. He's just. He, he's crazy. He's just trying to stop the camera. Let me just say that with last minute Christmas shopping, I try to avoid doing like any last minute Christmas anything because it just gets like super crazy. So I go to Ulta, I'm like getting my little makeup or whatever and I'm at the MAC station and I'm like okay like I need a lipstick and I can't find it. I was trying really hard. Julian's the camera. She's trying really hard. <laughs> Puppies. <laughs> Come here. Okay, so I was trying not to bother the girl because from what it looked like, it was just one person working at the MAC station and she was doing somebody's makeup. So I'm like trying to look for my lipstick. I can't find it. So I'm like, okay, I'm just going to ask her. I look over and I'm like, hey, um, I'm looking for Bronx. Do you guys carry it? And she's like, no, we don't carry that one here. So I'm like, okay, like I keep looking and I'm like, do you guys carry sexy? She's like, yeah, it's somewhere right there. It's on top. So tell me why I'm like looking through all these lipsticks. I don't know if I'm just dumb or blind or what the hell, but I could not find the damn lipstick for the life of me. And like, I'm feeling bad because she's the only one there. And so I look over and I'm like, oh, is there somebody that could help me? She's like, oh, is there somebody I can help? Puffy's here. So, so, so I look over and I'm like, hey, well, is there anybody that could help me? 
help me. She's like, we're really short staffed. I'm the only one here. And I'm just like, bro, like I just need you to point out where this damn lipstick is for me. So I don't know. I just felt like she was being like super rude. I worked in customer service, so like I understand it's like the holidays, it's hectic. Like she's probably just like over everybody and like the chaos. But you know what? It's not my fault. Like I just needed you to point out where the damn lipstick was at. I don't know. I don't know if I was just like being too much. Juliana. I didn't want to make it a big deal, so I just let it go. I didn't even get the damn lipstick. We ended up. There was a big, big line. That's why there's like it was yeah. like all the way to the back. Julian's behind the camera and he's just having so much fun with that light. <laughs> Needless to say, we ended up just walking out of Alta. It was crazy. Okay, so the next gift we got is Jacob's brother, his younger brother. We picked up this cute little like sweater or jacket. I don't know, but we picked this up for him. And he's actually a freshman in high school, so I think he'll really like this. Like, look at the inside, how soft it is. So we're gonna put this one in this bag. Do you want this bag for Joseph, Leah? No. No, different one. Back to you. So I choose the little snowman. It's so cute. Actually, and it has like a little, uh, a little kind of thing. And this is so cute. To me, it kind of looks like a gingerbread house. I don't know why. That looks like frosting. And guys, I love this paper. It's like so pretty. Show me in. So please Love let him play with it. Paper and... So that way he gets entertained. Okay. So I, I'm thinking I want to put this video here. Let me put one. I'm thinking I want to have this video go live like after Christmas because I do know that my mother in law. Okay. I am going to reveal my secret Santa. So we're doing secret Santa at Jacob's mom's. Tell me why I got my mother in law and Jacob got my father in law. Like, how does that happen? How do we end up with the parents? It's all right though, like I'm not complaining, I'm just saying that, how does that happen? So anyway, my secret Santa, like I said, is my mother-in-law, and I know she watches my videos, so I'm thinking I'm gonna upload this video, or I'm gonna have it go live the day of Christmas, or the day after Christmas, I'm not too sure. Grandma, make sure you subscribe. So speaking of grandma, should we just show them what we got her? So I got her a cute little outfit. I'm gonna post a picture here because I feel like just showing it to you guys isn't gonna give it any justice. But we got her this cute little two-piece set. These are the pants, and it's a nice little like brown color. I love this color. And this is the top. It's a little tube top, and it looks so freaking cute on the model, like, doesn't it? I love this little set. And then I got her these little sandals to go with that set if she wants to. She doesn't have to pair it with the set, but I think that looks super cute. And these are sandals. And then I also got a little necklace for her. It's just like a little bar, like a simple little necklace, oh, it's just, but it's, it's super cute. It's just a like, you guys can't really see it. Yeah, it's like a little bar, but it's, it, just it's like super a cute. Do you want to pick up the bag that you want to wrap it in? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so um, we already wrapped that up, and I also got my grandma something, but I'm not gonna bring it out right now. Should I show them? We'll do that one last. Yeah, we're gonna do that one last. Or maybe we'll, I don't know. Maybe we'll, I don't know. We just got everything stacked up, and we're just kind of going through it. I mentioned how my dad is coming. He's coming last minute. He ended up coming home early from Mexico, and he also ended up bringing his knees back with him. And so he's going to be bringing her for Christmas. And I didn't want her to be here. Keep in mind, I've never met her. None of us have ever met her. I saw her because Sophia showed me her. Oh, really? Yeah, she, she's like, say hi, say hi. And I was like, oh, my God. And, and her name is... Can you say hi? Yeah. Okay. She's like, say hola, say hola. I said hola. And I'm like, oh, my God, Sophia. Yeah, so I think she was born in Colorado. And she talks lived, in Spanish. Yeah, she's lived in Mexico all her life. But um, anyway, she came back with my dad and she's gonna be staying with my dad for a while. She's gonna be getting a job here the whole night. So he's gonna be bringing her for Christmas and I didn't want her to just like be here while everybody's like opening up presents. And she's 18 years old. So I only felt it would be right for me to get her something. Like, like I said, I don't want her just sitting there like everybody's opening up presents. 
So I honestly, I never met her. I had no idea what to get her, but I felt like I couldn't go wrong with this. I ended up getting her a little hair straightener. I think this is like a necessity, like something you need. And she's 18 years old. I don't know if she has one, but I feel like everything's a straightener, right? So we got her the straightener. We picked out the bag. And I think she'll like this. I hope she'll like it. We took a little break. We actually got some Costco pizza earlier, so that's what Maya's having. Got some water. And the next gift we're going to wrap is the second gift exchange or secret Santa, whatever you want to call it. So we ended up finding these shoes for him and Jacob thought he'd really like these them. These are the shoes. <laughs> <laughs> so these are the shoes we picked up for him. And I really like the color. They're suede. They're super nice. Jacob actually really likes them too, but I feel like this is something he'd really like. So yeah, we got these for my father-in-law. And what bag do you want to put them in, Maya? Do you want to pick up the bag? So Maya's picking out this little bag. Like I said, we went easy. We're going easy, all right? We picked out bags for a lot of these presents because you know what? It's hard wrapping presents. It's hard wrapping a lot of presents. What color paper do you think would look good, Red? What do you think? Looks good, huh? are not twins. These little babies are twins. Look at them. Oh, you get your show you. Do you want to help us wrap one? Yeah. yeah. No, he's too busy eating. He's eating his little pizza. <laughs> Puppies. I want to wrap my dad's present next. Let me show you guys what I got him. So I went to Costco and you know what? Costco actually has a lot of cute things. And so I found him this shirt there. Jacob actually also ended up really liking it. So I went back and I got Jacob one too. So I got my dad this and then I also got him this little sweater, which I also felt like was my dad's vibe for sure. So it's this little blue sweater and my dad wears things like this like i could see him rocking this so i got him that and then maya picked out a little santa bag what color tissue paper do you think we should use for this one so we did like a blue what do you think i don't know i feel like i wish this is kind of more like a turquoise blue like this but that's fine it looks cute huh yeah say hi Joy. You don't want to say hi? Oh, you're so funny. It's not like he said the horse Julian. No, it's the horse Julian. Oh. You're so handsome, puppy. Okay, so we're going to wrap um great grandma's present next. And we actually got her this cute little sweater. We always see her in little sweaters, so I thought she'd really like this. So this is for great grandma. It's a nice little color. And what bag do you want to use for grandma? For Alita. Yeah. Maya calls her Alita. She's so cute because Maya speaks Spanish, but she's not fluent in Spanish. So when she was little, she always used to say, like we tell her to say Abuelita, and she used to say Alita. It's the cutest thing ever. So we kind of just stuck with that. When I go like this, Abby. kind of stuck and every time now we refer to like great grandma because she calls her grandma grandma and uh, actually you you have three grandmas this is getting confusing <laughs> but she calls her great great that would be Amaya's great great grandma Alita and so I don't know when she was a baby it was the cutest thing ever what color kind of tissue paper do you want to use? Pink? Okay. I think so. I'm pretty sure she does. Okay, grab it from the corner there. Oh, yeah. And then put it in. Okay, now we're going to do grandma. Okay. I'm telling you, it's good. this is getting confusing. Well, because I'm... Um, and this is so for this Ruskin. is for her great-grandma. I don't know why it's always been a thing 
like with her, everybody calls her by her name. I know it's weird, but everybody refers to her as Raquel, which is actually her great grandma. So we but, got her this. Yeah, for Raquel, we got her that. It's a cute little sweater. And then we also got her this little shirt, and we got her that shirt in this pretty color too. Jacob actually helped me pick Raquel's gift because she she has done a lot for us. After I had Julian, I mentioned on here that I've had C-sections with both of them. Amaya was actually an emergency C-section. But after I came home, if you've had a C-section, you know, the first week, you could barely, like, it's just hard to do anything. You can't even stand up straight. It is the worst pain ever. But after I had Julian, I had um, my C-section, I came back home and I couldn't do anything. She came over, she helped clean my house, which she didn't have to do. She made me food, like she was taking care of me and I love her so much for that. And then actually and then she while, was cleaning over there too. Yeah, and then do you remember while I was at the hospital, because I had to be at the hospital for like two or three days, she watched Amaya for us and she's she's done a lot so i love her a lot so maya picked out this little bag for grandma because she likes little cute stuff like this <laughs> she does we're done with the bags the rest of the gifts we have we're actually gonna wrap we actually got them both toys because they're both kids i love so robux for her cousin levi he's three years old we got him this little robux toy and, and then, then her cousin sophia that's eight years old we got her this little doll and I actually got her this little doll because I got Amaya one of these and she really liked Amaya's doll like Amaya even came up to me and she was like Sophia keeps wanting to play with my toy so I think she'll really like this this one's mine Julian babies <laughs> yeah that one is Maya's and I, mean, I said that Sophia why do you even like it it's pink you don't even like pink and she's like well I like it and I'm like wow you want to show them your wrapping skills it's because I've done this before. I've done a little video. A little that was a little time consuming, but we got it wrapped. <laughs> now you put the tape on there. It looks good. It looks good. Okay, so what um, bow do you want to pick? Oh, you chose red? Yeah. Okay. Where do you want to put it? Oh, let me take the back piece off. Congratulations if you chose red. Julian, what are you doing? Stop us. Come. Should we let Julian put the bow on? No, but then. Okay, you put it. Okay, where do you want to put your cousin's cousin? <laughs> Maya. Um, Rap with your kids, they say. It'll be fun, they say. We have one last gift to wrap, and this gift, even though it's not like anything crazy, it's super meaningful, especially for Maya, because she picked everything out, but she wanted to get her grandma a little something. Do you want to show them what you got grandma? So I took her to the store, and she picked a couple of things out she thought her grandma would like. She got her this cute little basket. She picked out some socks. She picked out these hair clips, the little vase. And what'd you do with this, Maya? What's I put this inside. So she also did like a little note for her. Maya really wanted to include a picture of grandma with her brother. She chose this picture, but she wanted to include that in there because I mentioned on here that he actually passed away. It's been a year now. She thought it made her feel good, and I actually liked it. I liked the little idea of the picture. So that's the last thing we have left to wrap. We have a couple of gift bags left. Do you want to put it inside a gift bag? Woo! Right here. 